Hi, in this video we will see how to integrate Hadoop with HANA system. Now, Hadoop stores huge amount of unstructured data and you can combine the computing power of SAP HANA to analyze that data. You can create new remote connection to Hadoop system in HANA studio and you can perform read and write operation to manipulate the data in Hadoop. You can also connect to Hadoop system in remote connection using SQL statement. But you need to pass the details of web HDFS and web HCAT URL of Hadoop system details and authentication details. Operations can be performed without loading data to HANA database. Let us move to HANA studio and see the integration of Hadoop with HANA system. In this tutorial, we will see how we can do the integration with Hadoop and SAP HANA. So in SAP HANA system, we can integrate SAP HANA computing power with the Hadoop to process the huge amount of data at faster speed. Hadoop system is used for storing the huge amount of unstructured data and HANA provides the high speed data analysis. So to use the smart data access to connect to Hadoop system in SAP HANA studio, we have to select the adapter for the SAP HANA and Hadoop. So, Let's go to the SAP HANA studio. This is my SAP HANA studio and I am connected to this HANA system here. For that connection with Hadoop, we have to expand it. We have to go to the provisioning and here we have to create the new remote source. So if I right click here and go to the new remote source, it will open up the window here. In this we have to select the source name. So let's say if we give the source name as test underscore Hadoop. After that, we have to select the adapter name. So here in the drop down, we have the option of Hadoop ODBC. So we have to select the Hadoop ODBC option. In this, we can see that we have to enter all these details. That is the connection properties. That is the adapter version, connection mode, data source name, DML mode. And here we have to give the credentials. So all these things we have to specify here in the connection for configuring the connection to the Hadoop database. We can also use the statement SQL statement to create a remote connection to connect to the Hadoop system. So let's see how we can create it using the SQL statement. So I have copied that statement here. So the, if I copy this statement and if I go to the SQL editor here, that is my SQL console. And if we copy this statement here, so what it is doing is it is creating the remote source with the name RC underscore Hadoop. And after that here the adapter type is Hadoop and this is the configuration. So here we have to enter the full qualified domain name and then the port number, then the URL for the web server. So all these details and then we have to pass the credentials. That is the password and using the username and the password this. So here we are saying that authentication type is the password and we have to use this username and password for the authentication. So once we will run this statement and if I go to the remote sources here, if I expand and refresh it, so we can see that this connection is created here. So this is how we can create the Hadoop connection with the SQL. So this way we can integrate the SAP HANA system with the Hadoop using the smart data integration in HANA studio. Thank you.